Hola, buenas noches. Muchas gracias por la entrevista. Good evening. Thank you for this interview. Thank you for the time. Uh, congratulations. Uh, I, I imagine the emotions are still kind of setting in right now, but, but what is the feeling for you? Gracias por tu tiempo. Me imagino que las emociones están así a, a full, pero ¿cómo te sientes en momento? Salud. <laughs> that explains it all. ¿Lo abriste? ¿Lo abriste? It's open. Ah. It's, it's, this is a legit sip. <laughs> sí, la verdad que me siento muy agradecido. Sabía, mientras lo amor Raúl Trump, me dijo que si da una buena pelea, no importaba el, el resultado. Y la verdad que le agradezco a él por la estrategia y, y se lo debo a él ahora. Um, you know, thank you so much. Very, very grateful. You know, Raúl from Interim actually told me, um, if you put on a good fight, they, 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 he knew, like, if you put on a good fight, it doesn't matter the result. He's going to look at effort and he's going to look at this. And that's what I did. I went with everything and I put on a good effort. And there he goes. Overall, like you said, a great effort, but I'm sure not the result you wanted in the fight. I mean, at, at the fight's conclusion, how did you feel about your performance? Obviamente, el esfuerzo se veía, pero el resultado no fue aquel que, que esperabas. De cualquier manera, ¿cómo te, sent, cómo, ¿cómo te sentiste cuando terminó la pelea? Eh, si, sin desmerecer a mi rival, pensé que era un poco más duro, eh, eh, tal vez en el wrestling, pero la verdad que pude pararme tranquilamente. Eh, la verdad que tuve un poco de nervio al principio por pelear en este en las grandes ligas, ¿no? Pero la verdad que me sentí como dentro de todo. Me faltó lanzar un poco más de volumen. Eh, no pude patear por ciertos problemas que venía en el camp, pequeños problemitas. Pero la verdad que sí, sí. Hay mucho que mejorar, pero hubo una buena performance de, para mí. I don't want to, you know, put down um, or, or, you know, just under, uh, uh, underestimate or, or actually, um, you know, say anything about my opponent. But I really thought he was going to be tougher that. I expected, especially in the wrestling. And and there I was, I was able to actually defend the takedowns, keep standing up, and um, obviously um, I was able to keep up with him. Uh, I think I could have done better. There are things that we, I can improve. For example, I, I maybe I should have you know, just gone a little more for it, um, put some more volume. There's a lot of stuff to actually improve, but I felt that I, that I had a good fight. So the story goes, you go back to the hotel, you get told to come here, when do you figure out that you have a like? When did you actually understand you were getting a UFC contract? La historia que volviste al hotel te llamaron y te dijeron regresa. ¿Cuándo fue el exacto momento que te diste cuenta que el contrato era tuyo? Estábamos volviendo ahí con un con un amigo mío que traje Bolivia y y le dije fuck man, no van a llevar al hospital y ya ni modo le dije perdimos toda la noche y cuando llegué qué pasó? No, este no es el hospital de Y nada, todo fue sorpresa, la verdad que hasta ahorita no me la puedo creer y, y voy a dar la talla, voy a dar la talla para, para la UFC. Vamos a bajar eh, oficialmente a las 185 libras. Um, it's, I, I, I was back, I was going back with a friend of mine um, from Bolivia and we we're like, man, no way, I mean, lost the fight, not getting this. Uh, and all of a sudden we're like, hold up a second. I mean, they're going to take me to the hospital. I'm like, hold up a second, this ain't the hospital. So um, I came back and everything was surprised. Everything that you saw, you know, where are you going to go? What are you going to do? And I still cannot believe that I'm here. You know, I'm in the big leagues here just to be in this thing. Um, but we're going to go for it all. And uh, we're going to make some, some history at 185. And Dana said he was told that you've never had a true MMA coach before now. Is that accurate? Y Dana ha dicho a nosotros acá durante la entrevista, supongo que nunca has tenido un coach exactamente de artes marciales mixtas. ¿Eso es verdad? ¿Que no has tenido un coach específico? Sí, sí, lo tuve, pero hace tres años que me entreno yo solo. Entonces voy a hacer campamento y vuelvo, voy a hacer campamento y vuelvo. Y yo entreno a mi propia gente para que sea mi jeparrin. Uh, I've had MMA coaches in the past, but for the past three years I have trained myself. So I go, do camp, come back. I do do camp, come back. I actually train people to be my sparring partners. All right. Last thing, I think you touched on. Uh, the future is at, at middleweight. That's where you see yourself continuing in the UFC? Eh, también algo que mencionaste, el futuro, el 55, es esto. Es, es ahí que estás en la UFC, en esta edición. Sí, la verdad que nos pasamos mucho en el corte de peso. Y mi coach me dijo, no, vos sos una 185 libras, entonces... De ahora en adelante yo le hago caso a todo lo que él me diga. Uh, I, it, I mean, we, we couldn't get through the, I mean, during the weight cut, he was very, very clear, and everybody that was assisting me and coaches was like, this is it, this is 185, and there's nothing much that we're going to do past that. I mean, this is, it's, that's it, 185 it is. 
no sé, um, durante la pelea tu esquina te decía, párate, párate, párate. ¿Sentiste alguna frustración durante todo eso? Um, during the fight, your corner was saying, just, you know, stand up, stand up, stand up. There, was there any frustration during the, the fight? La verdad que yo sentía que él cargaba la patada. Entonces, me levantaba un poco tranquilo porque sentía que si me levantaba de uno, que es lo que él quería, me, me iba a patear y tal vez me conectaba, ¿no? Entonces, por eso lo tomé un poco con calma levantarme. Oh, sorry. Uh, um, actually, during the fight, I felt that if I stood up a little more, too much and I just basically kind of raised my you know got into a, a stand-up position he was really gonna get me and connect with kicks so I was very hesitant just kind of like hey I'm not gonna stand up that much so I just took my time um, to get into standing y después de la pelea mencionaste tu amor por Bolivia y toda Latinoamérica. ¿Cómo se siente ver todo el crecimiento de las artes marciales mixtas en Latinoamérica? ¿Y tienes algún mensaje para los fanáticos de Latinoamérica? Uh, during the interview, when actually you found out the, that you got the contract, you talked about all your love for Bolivia and all for Latin America. Uh, you could see the passion there. So, any messages that you have for anyone, in, for everyone in Bolivia and everyone in Latin America? Crean, crean en su sueño. Yo ya perdí, perdí la lucha. Y miren cómo me dieron un contrato, o sea, es trabajo duro, no importa si no tenés entrenador, habla, mensaje por Instagram, alguien si te puede entrenar y, y todo se puede, todo se puede. Uh, believe, believe in your dreams. Um, it, it, it's listen. I lost the fight, and here I was. Just continue to train, continue to go at it. I didn't have a coach. Just find people to train. I, I don't send send some DMs unto people who say, hey, you want to come train with me? Just Continue to do things, just go for it all, um, keep doing it, and you'll come back. Felicitaciones. Gracias. Hablaste un poco de peso medio. ¿Es posibilidad real? ¿Has peleado antes en esa categoría? Y esperamos verte en, ese, en tu futuro ahí. Um, you talked about middleweight in the past. Have you fought a middleweight before? Is there something that's a possibility? Peleé hace seis años, y la verdad que ahora que estoy con gente profesional, Sabían que tenía algunos déficits, me pusieron nutricionista y fue muy fácil llegar a la 205 que antes yo cortaba el triple y, y me costaba llegar a la 205. Ahora no me costó para nada, se lo agradezco a mi, a mi compañero de Entran, ahí del garaje. La verdad que sin ellos no lo hubiera logrado, pero, pero sí, fue tan fácil. Bueno, no fácil, ¿no? Porque toda la noche dormía con hambre, pero, <risa> pero sí, sí se puede, se puede. Está, está dentro del plan, por, evaluado por un nutricionista, ¿no? Um, I think that this um, I've done it in the past about six years ago, but I, you know, now I'm with professionals and with professionals. I mean, I saw even during the weight cut, it was just such a different thing. It was so smooth. I was able to actually reach weight at, that at the desired weight with no problem. Um, it, it was, it, it was smoother and it was, it was easy. I mean, easy, not that easy because I'm always hungry, but it was easier. And I, I, I think I can, and I can actually keep the weight. Y al final para mí, mencionaste algo de, no sé si te entendí bien, una lesión, por eso no pudiste tirar las patadas. Obviamente, pudiste pelear, aquí te vimos en acción, felicidades. Qué bueno que no sucedió algo más serio, pero ¿qué pasó con, con, con eso? And uh, you did mention a little bit um, something that of, of, of a particular injury that might have happened during camp, that for that you were able to actually uh, get the kicks going. Anything serious? What do you say about is that that really impedes you from actually having better performance? Eh, no, la verdad es que era una pequeña inflamación, pero pero cada que pateaba se, o sea, la la desinflamaba y pateaba y volvía a inflamar. Entonces decidimos cortar la patada. Entonces me sentí la verdad que sí un arma porque me tiraba la la calcil y yo quería devolvérsela y sabía que no podía. Um, actually, it is something that we talked about. I mean, I had a bit of inflammation in the process, so. It, it, everything, the, the inflammation would come down and all of a sudden I started kicking and it, came, it would come back. So we decided it was best to not do that. So it, it was kind of frustrating in the sense that every time he, he went for kicks, I, I really wanted to, to, to come back at him with calf kicks too, but I was like, I couldn't. So I had to hold myself a little bit. Gracias, man. Felicidades. Viva Bolivia. Viva Bolivia. Thank you.